Listen, I want you to start selling what Marcus Young is going to be six months from now. Then they're going to turn around real quick. Exactly. See, you and I are going to do great things. Watch. So I'm in Texas right now. We have one more game against the Vipers, but then after that, I want you to... Yeah, uh, I'll call you back tomorrow. I didn't hear you. It's your room, too. You can take a call. Yeah, but I just didn't want to take it in the hallway because everybody would hear me asking, like, Marcus, what's going on, you know? <laughs> you know how it is. Yeah, yeah, man, I get it. Yeah. Only a matter of time. All right, well, um, you know what? I'll let you get back to it. And uh, I'm sure you got a few more phone calls nah, to make. No, nah, no, nah, I got too much energy. I'm about to go get a run in. You can take the room. Plus, you look real tired anyway. You know, there's more to this game than taking the last shot and getting your numbers. Corey Harris taught me that. Oh, really? Tell me more. Were you guys on the beach with the stars? <laughs> man, go take your walk, man. I met plenty of people like you, AI. You know nothing about me, bro. You think you're special. You think the whole world revolves around your thoughts, your feelings. I got a family and people counting on me just like you. There's 491 players in the NBA. Most of them, like Corey Harris, they blue blood, so everything was just handed to them. But the rest of us, we down here, we gotta fight for the few spots that they didn't take. So if the only chance I have is by stepping over my competition, I'm going to do that by any means necessary. And right now, that's you. You better believe if I got to go through you, I'm going to slice you right down the middle and clear that path. Doesn't have to be that way, man. It does have to be that way. And you know it. Even though your little girlfriend downtown got your brain off. Don't you dare bring her into this. Whoa. Don't you dare talk about her. Whoa. Don't you dare. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Touch the nerve. Try it again. I dare you. Hey! Hey! Knock it off! Knock it off, guys! You lay one hand on him, and you're benched against the Vipers, okay? You too, Marcus. I'm serious. I don't know what started this, and I don't care. It ends right here, right now. You got me? Do you got me? Yes, coach. Yeah, coach. Come on, guys. I came up coaching high school volleyball, okay? And those kids never gave me this amount of grief. Not once! By the way, it's a very complicated sport. Don't know that I ever fully got it. That's beside the point. Get your gear. You're rooming with Howie now. Oh, dude, awesome. Yeah, we just got to get you some earplugs. Oh, Howie, do us all a favor, dude. Go to the drugstore, get one of those nasal strips, staple it to your nose. Well, no, Doc says it's hereditary. It's so. not hereditary, dude. I'm telling you, okay? You have a serious medical condition. And the rest of you guys, why don't we try to act like adults, okay? It's clearly hard for us to behave like basketball players, so let's just be adults. All right, let's go, guys. Let's go hit the showers. children. Tracy Hooper was given the liver of a nine-year-old accident victim in a four-hour operation. Hooper is in critical but stable condition, normal after such an operation. Her condition will be monitored for 72 hours to see if there's any sign of organ rejection. Rick Manson's World Motion Tour is over, and what a success it was. Manson skateboarded across Canada in 11 months, raising over $14 million to fight heart disease. He covered over 5,000 miles, averaging about 100 miles per day. Manson says he wants to thank all who donated to his cause and wants to remind us that even though his journey is over, the battle against heart disease must continue. Tom and Harriet Banks are the lucky winners of this past weekend Super Lottery draw. The pair came forward to claim the million dollar prize. Hey, I! Oh, it smells like exhaustion and sadness in here. You're lucky I got some medication. Uh... Why does this look like something I need an alibi for? I know how you get hard on yourself, okay? So I was walking back from the pharmacy, anti-snore strips in hand, when I ran into this guy in the alley. And he looked tweaky, but he knew a guy. Who called the guy? And... BAM! <laughs> whoa, 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 hey. Pretty sure fireworks are illegal here, bro. Not when we're five miles from the Mexican border. 
Mm, somehow that makes him sound more illegal. Will you relax? Fireworks are legal within city limits, and since we're in the middle of nowhere, you can lighten up, my friend. By lighting up. What do you say? Uh, I'm only gonna ask one more time. Let's do it. Hey, hey come on, man. Oh. Quiet down. I'm not any louder than the fireworks are gonna be. Look, I'm just trying to make sure the coach doesn't notice us. I'm already on thin ice. Let's be honest, man. We played like garbage tonight. We were uptight. We were stiff. That the road's getting to us. For the good of the team, man, you need to chill. Right, right. Blow Listen, off some steam. I'm having a great time. I just want to make sure I keep having a great time by not getting caught. Oh, well then. Here's a big old double shot of crap time right here. I'll light one end, you light the other. Aim it, let's not hit the bus. Five, four, four three, two, two one. <laughs> I told you. Oh, I think I'm in love. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, uh, 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 Howie? Uh, Yo, Howie? Uh, oh, Howie? Oh, no! oh, oh! Uh, yeah, I, I think it's time we, uh... Yeah, we're inside. Okay, let's just say that this didn't happen. What didn't happen? Nothing happened. Run! All right, everybody, listen up, listen up. Unfortunately, the fire department says the cause of this fire is most likely fireworks. Some kind of projectile. Pow! Okay, and I'm especially bummed because I lost all my cool clothes in the fire! Now the fire department has to go inside the building and make sure it's all safe for us before we return. And guess what? That's time we don't have. That might take all night. Howie. Huh? I'm, uh, well, yeah. Yeah? Did you go to the drugstore? No. Get those breathing strips like I told you? No. I, I mean, yeah, yes. Breathing clear, sir. All right, good hustle. Thanks, coach. The rest of you guys are going to hustle onto the bus. And I'm gonna try to figure out who started this fire! What kind of basketball team burns down their own hotel? On the bus. Everybody. You can't leave me hanging like that. <laughs> Wait, what what you mean? Come to our game again. Da da da, that's all you said. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, my bad. Um, I'm in our game against the Memphis Hustle. It's our last road game, classic. Playing in the old school gym in Nice Town. Yeah, yeah, I'll definitely be there. Can't wait to see you. What's wrong? <sighs> Nothing, just um, the road, this game. You're on the right path, AI. The bigger vision, it's there. Yeah, that's what Big Toonie keeps saying. What? Big Toonie? That's like seeing Bigfoot or Einstein and they had an encyclopedic knowledge of the Eurostep. You met him? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I actually met him a couple times. Okay, and this is the first time that you're telling me? This is the first thing we're talking about when I get into Night's Down. All right, get some sleep. Yeah, yeah, that, uh, that might be a problem. How come? Mm, well, uh, there was a fire at the hotel. What? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, everybody's, everyone's totally fine. It's just, um, you know, just a crazy accident. Uh, but, you know, we sleep on the bus tonight, so... Never a dull moment. 